Hey, beautiful people, it's Kevin. Oh, my neck. I'm playing with my necklace. Here comes little Luna. One nut. All right, we got Luna. Same one's getting down. Getting Luna sleep. Where are you going, Luna? Luna, is it precious? Oh, you too cute. She not cute. Wait a minute. Let's look at Sale. Oh, Sale is a big man. Appreciate him. I'm a big man. I'm a big Tommy cat. Look how big I'm getting. Look how big they've got. I got these kittens on August 30th, and he weighed 12.7 ounces. Uh, ounces. Yeah, 12.7 ounces. And now he's like close to three pounds. This is big. Anyway, so I went to the Dollar Tree. Went to Dollar Tree. And I found these cups. My kid Patrick loves these cups. He likes to uh, put his drinks in there so they don't get knocked over and spill. And of course, you got a straw, you don't have to worry about pushing the lid off. And I noticed today that had some little blue pickup trucks with a, a barn scene with some fall leaves and pumpkins. And these cups, I've noticed, uh, are harder to find at the Dollar Tree. I don't know why. I didn't see any this summer. His, his broke. So I bought two of them. Little blue pickup trucks and barns. With pumpkins and fallen leaves. That's cute, right? It must be a thing with them this season. I walked over to the oven mitts and Pot holders and they have a matching set for that too, just like the cup. You get two pot holders for a dollar still. So I thought, why not? They're cute. I need a new set after I take my Halloween down. Before, I don't know, you know, if I only find Christmas this year. Yeah, you know, I'll leave them up for, for January. <laughs> right, right. Oh, yes, yes, Miss Luna. Luna, Luna, Luna. She's a loony girl. <laughs> loony. Yeah. Let them see your neck so they know it's you. <laughs> Not your brother pretending to be you. Alright. Anyway, I just thought it was funny that. Dollar Tree all matchy matchy. Uh, I needed the cups because he goes through quite a few of them. Then I found some Christmas things. These are just for fun. One for Patrick and one for my grandson Tyrion. They're little light up things. Some projector lights. They this is a snowman one. They had another one that had like a like a rooftop scene with sand on his sled going across the top. I thought the snowman was prettier. My grandson goes around singing Frosty the snowman all year long. I thought he liked that. It won't last but a few weeks for my kid, Patrick, to eat or Drops and breaks it or it gets misplaced. I got some tape. I have to get colored tape when I'm sealing up packages. Just get a little festive look. So I got red today. It'd be good for Christmas. 
Valentine's Day if I get that far with this tape. <laughs> They said uh, they don't have as much tape on there as they used to. These Dollar Tree prices are going up, so you better get there and get you some stuff. I got a, I got another laser pointer. Patrick breaks these too. He plays with them with the cats for a little bit, but then he turns around eventually breaks them and they don't work. I don't know how he does it. I guess he unscrews the top from the bottom so many times that he just wants he uh, strips the, the um, threads he won't stay on there. And of course, every time you pick it up, the bears fly out. You just throw it in the trash. I got a uh, roller cutter. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, I'm going to try to use this with that cosplay costume we're making. That's right. I don't, I don't know. I've never used one of these before, but I thought it'd be easier to do it around like corners and stuff and scissors. I broke down and brought me another thing, candy corn. Get that. Mm, get that candy corn. Okay, and then I got a couple things for my pantry. Uh, I don't know if you say emergency pantry because I don't know how well you would need apple pie filling in an emergency, but, but since these things are a pretty good size, 21 ounce. Mm -hmm. One pound, five ounces of apple pie filling for only a dollar. Hmm. Got two of them. You better stock up on your things at Dollar Tree before your Dollar Tree raises the prices. Now I did get, I want to uh, take a tote or something and make like an emergency prepper storage kit thing. In case you saw this on the uh, Jamarell large family table and she was talking she had she actually went and bought backpacks I ain't gonna I ain't gonna do all that I'll just take one little tote plastic tote with a lid and I'll put some food and water in there enough for a couple days anyway she was talking about these at the Dollar Tree this little tunas and a bumblebee tuna and you don't need a can opener, you just like rip it open and it's got a, a fork in there. She was talking about this was the only place she's seen that had a little plastic spark at the top. She was saying how funny it was they give you little utensils to eat your your tuna. Whatever. So I got roasted garlic herb. Got a couple of them for my emergency little stash. Yeah, I haven't even bought the container to hold it all yet. We'll probably have like a can opener and some Chef RD. You tell Kelly you ain't going to be going all out. Oh, lemon pepper. Oh, lemon and pepper. Two lemon and peppers and two for my emergency stash. Why not? <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting one. Wow. Here he comes back. Here he comes back. Here he comes back. <laughs> I know it's him. Whoopsie. Let me pick you up, little ones. Oh, he smacked her in the face. <laughs> she got away. Oh, there's a man you. Man, you Salem, you wild animal, you. This is not my house panther. Let me down. Let me be free, woman. Look what I got yesterday. Found this at the uh, at the Kroger. He was the last one. Squished mellows. His name is Tally. He's a vampire. 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 
Ah! You got me. What are you that for? Why are you biting? What? You're biting. There's Luna. there. Luna loves jelly. Sometimes with bad lighting, all I can see is their little mouth when they open and their little teeth, their little teeth, and their little nails coming at me. I'm a piranha. Are you a piranha? I'm a piranha. I can place my hair. Alright, go on. Hey, my beautiful people. Check out a book from the library. Howling Tricks, Treats, Fun, and Sweets. I got a lot of manga. And we got manga. Alright, I'm gonna make some of these pink pumpkin muffins here. I'm and we're substituting the raisins for chocolate for chips. Substitute those raisins for chocolate chips, milk chocolate chips. We should do way better. And, you know, milk chocolate chips are way better than raisins. I hate raisins. Yeah, I remember raisins. as a kid, my mom used to make me ants on a log. Raisins are the devil's candy. We used to go to, like, birthday parties and they had ants on a log. You know what ants on a log if you're an old person like me. I know what ants on a log is. Because I told you. Ants on a log is celery stick covered with peanut butter. There's little raisins on the top. It is not good. Uh, of course, we didn't have that Pinterest back then. A birthday party when I went. As a kid, you got like a Kool-Aid, cake, ice cream, and uh, sometimes they had tiger chips. Ants on a log and uh, little bowls of peanuts. <laughs> okay. Whatever. Have the heck game like pin the tail on the donkey. Kids don't know how good they have it these days. Anyways, pumpkin muffins, apple, pumpkin fruit. I've had apple fruit, but I've never had pumpkin fruit. So maybe. A recipe for pumpkin pie. I just buy it in the store and cook it in the oven. I ain't got time for that. Cranberry fudge. So I don't know. Just a second ago, the cats crawled in my blanket. Spellbound tart. It looks good. I've never had a tart before, I don't think. I don't think I've ever had a tart before either. I'll show you how to make a pumpkin cake. That's pretty awesome. I don't know. To make that toffee apples. I can't eat it. raw apple. Ghost cake. Ooh, I think this would be good for Christmas. Gingerbread cookies. Mm, gingerbread. I'll show you how to make homemade marshmallows. I never even knew that you could do that. Smiling the star. Then I'll show you how to make uh, put your ghost makeup on. Do makeup. Hmm. Oh, that's Frankenstein's monster. The witch. I need to look at this. I'll get my witch makeup on point. Skeleton. Vampire. Oh, okay. Cat, that's me. Everybody wants to be a cat, cause the cat's the only cat that knows where it's at. Anyway. 
So you gotta carve some creepy jack lanterns. You can get a lot of things at the library. They even have cake pans that you can borrow. So I was thinking about borrowing one at Christmas. Should I show them my TV? I don't have it. Oh. Wait a second. At your local library, you can borrow books too. Do it. <laughs> I guess okay. you. We got this for a dollar. They have a book set ongoing, and uh, I got this DVD set, Fruits Basket, uh, for only a dollar. It's got a cat on there, so you see the cat. <laughs> Oh no, oops, she ran away before I can pull her back out. Well, they're all very aggravating the old lady mouse. Mouse is trying to come off like she's an old lady. She's only four. Mm -hmm. She's like, hey little whipper snappers, I'm trying to rest. <laughs> but she's all too polite. She she growls but she doesn't show her teeth. She goes and then she timidly sticks her poly out and well, like, taps him on the head. <laughs> I got the I got the 2001 version of Fruits Basket. There's different versions. Oh, there's the new one and this one, and the old one. <sighs> Now that you know what I wasted money on at the Dollar Tree. I also got some frozen pizza. Ooh, frozen pizza. You don't eat frozen pizza from Dollar Tree. Oh, I got, got different kind. Anyway. It's time to start getting my package together for Christmas. Mom got me some soda. Well, carry on. I'm going to drink that later. I'm gonna get my little package together. I like that they have matching sets at the Dollar Tree. That's a good nice. Tape together. You're you gonna really make your little uh, prepared which emergency one do you think, kit. Which one do you think would taste better? The lemon and pepper or the garlic and herb? Oh, I don't know. I bet the garlic. I think a lemon pepper is probably good. Anyway, they're only a dollar. I thought it'd be good to stick them into a little tote box. Stick under the bed with some water and some canned soup and puddings and crackers and things. You never know. That's what Jamarell says. Of course, I'm not going to go all out and buy each of my family members a backpack and seal off a little the gallon size of this is breakfast and this is lunch and you got your emergency uh, set of clothes a flashlight and you know i ain't gonna do all that that's too much work man i'll just stick some food in a plastic tote for the day and call it a day food and water maybe stick some cat food in there in case you got to go in a hurry just Chunk it up and throw it in the back of the car and on your way you go. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Anyway, I'll catch you cool cats and kittens back here another day. This is Kelly of Kelly's room with Reborn's cats and nonsense. <sighs> and today the nonsense is matchy matchy at the Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. You can get you a tumbler with that little truck that's way over done. Yeah, it's way overdone. Way overdone. You can get you some pot holders, two of them for a dollar, and an oven mitt of a dollar. Hello, Paul. Mm -hmm. Of course, they didn't get this in until recently, so Paul was started like a month ago. It'll be alright, right? Bye bye. 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 Bye.